soap bubbles out of a bubble maker. I collect golden golden foils from different chocolates and keep it in books. Now they don't multiply, only peacock feathers multiply, <laughs> which I also happen to collect. Whenever I see a pet dog being walked by its owner, I stand in the road and I keep staring at that dog. I love dogs and I'm not but I'm not allowed to keep one at home. My mother is just glad I don't go behind that dog. <laughs> at least once in a week, I hear my mother scream at me. Oh, for God's sake, act your age, Rashmi. I'm often accused of being childish for many of my random acts. I like to interpret that as childlike. Yes, I'm referring here to the child inside me. We all have that childlike nature within us. But over a period of time, a child inside us has been repressed and we are confined to live programmed and structured life like robots wherein we forget to enjoy the little gifts of life. Why do you think we felt free when we were kids? Let me tell you, we never wasted a minute thinking about the future. Our smiles used to reach our eyes. Mommy was the best. We never used to care what people used to think about when we used to smile or giggle or do stupid things. The world seemed to be colorful and perfect. Everything used to be easy. We never used to care or give importance for money or gadgets or gizmos or any other material possessions. A box of crayons and a notebook would make us travel the realms of awesomeness. <coughs> Children don't hold on to pain. Nor do they take a minute, longer than a minute, to come back to their normal, fun self if something goes wrong in their way. They are always active and positive for, and open for new adventures. They don't want a reason to be happy. They just are. We miss those times, don't we? To speak truly, even nature loathes us adults. Because only few adults actually see the nature. When was the last time you looked at the sun or watched droplets of water on a leaf when watering plants? The adults have a very superficial scene. If you observe a child, how it sees the nature, you will understand what I am talking about. The best example I can give here is the movie Tare is a Meat Bird. How many of you watched the movie? If you haven't, it is a must watch. In that, the director has beautifully ca captured and shown the innocence of a child. How that child protagonist is mesmerized by looking at a building construction and looking at the sparks coming out of an iron grinder, looking at the walls being painted. Ralph Waldo Emerson quotes, The true lover of nature is he whose inward and outward senses are truly adjusted to each other, one who has retained the spirit of infancy even into the era of manhood. What happens when we grow up as adults? Why can't we wake up laughing in the morning rather than thinking about the things we have to accomplish that day? Why do happy, carefree and curious kids turn into fearful, cynical, complex adults. What changes? Are we bemused because of the novelties of life's learning and experiences has worn off? Or is it the financial pressure that has turned the axis of our smile into a grimace? Or is it the frustration we carry upon our shoulders which makes us, which makes us lead our lives really bad? What happens? If you say it's the situation we face as adults, then I'll say no. Situations have not changed. Our reactions to them have changed. I never want to lose that sense of awe and wonder from ever seeing the star stars in the sky or a flying airplane. I never want to worry that one thing that keeps me vibrant, the child inside me. Keep the child inside, childlike nature within you alive. Now I'm not saying that run away from your responsibilities. I don't want to run away from my older self responsibilities. 
but I only want to do it with fun, play, delight, wonder and innocence. I decided long back that I keep my childlike nature inside me alive forever. Yeah. Even when I become 80 and I have grandkids in my room roaming, I still love, play, enjoy, believe in Harry Potter and a magical <laughs> world behind every wall. So go down your memory lane and recollect what made you happy when you were kids and what stopped you doing that once you grew up. Think, go home, have a pillow fight. Collect screws, nuts, bolts, get greedy for ice cream and chocolates. Go play in the rain, dance in the muck, do what you like. But do all this without caring if you are being chided for acting childish. I hope I awoke the child inside you. Do not surrender to the senescence or aging of mind. Mind might get old. Be a child in your heart. Oh.